and action. What's up, everybody? Back at it again as part of my deal with Tones. Still playing Guardians of the Galaxy. Let's see how far we can get today before about 8 o'clock when I start D&D. Share the stream real quick, get a sound check from my bros, and we end this bitch. Let's get this shit. Continue. Ah, shit. I at least should have loaded in the game. Oh, yes. Loading screens. The bane of existence. Just kidding. It's not that bad. All right. All right. How's everyone doing this wonderful Friday evening, afternoon, something like that? <sighs> yeah. It's now or never. I don't want to live forever. Let's get this bitch on the road. But up, but up. We still love it. Damn. Let's see, where did I get yesterday? Oh, yeah, we're in that fucking house doing random shit. Really? This shit again? Not where I was looking at all, but. Might need to top off the oil. Plugs are like new, so that's not the problem. It's funny how I guess that needs replacing. Earth has aged like 30 years or 40 years. That was Brandon, a little whenever loose. the timeline Couldn't is, be the but, cause uh, of the problem though. He still sees everything in his dream about the 80s. Yeah, be right there, mom. I like his hairstyle, but I wish it blended in to it flowing back. Cause that shit looks dumb. Looks like Meredith Quill. Fucking, where do you keep your carving knives? Uh, oh, there's one in the rooster. Door nearest the stove. All I see is a dull instrument fit for a child. <laughs> That's the one. I will have to bring you a Katathian blade on our next visit. There you are, Peter. I was just about to come out and call you again. Some things never change, I suppose. Ah, Peter Quill. Your mother was just telling us about your childhood. Just some of your better adventures? She also told us she had found a suitable mate for you. But you refused to see reason. Drax, you said that would stay between us. We've only been on Earth for half a day, Mom, and you're already playing matchmaker? I've waited this long for grandkids, Peter. Haven't you told her about Nikki, Peter? Nikki? Who's she? She is Peter Quill's illegitimate daughter. Your illegitimate granddaughter. Uh, I was trying to find the right time to tell you sounds like we need to have a serious talk over dinner peter why do i feel like i'm about to get grounded i can't believe you still have this the craftsmanship is shoddy at best be nice drax peter try yeah, probably is this the same radio you used to have yep Sounds better than ever, too. Oh, let's Don't make the things venom. like they used to. Mora, what did I say about putting your clothes in the wash with mine? That you'd be happy to take care of it? <laughs> up to what promise? We think what choice? I'm 
fucking confused. Did this bitch just killed me? Isn't there supposed to be like 16 chapters in this bitch? What the fuck? Hold on, bro. What is happening? Hey, yo, Tunes, what the fuck just happened in Guardians of the Galaxy, bruh? I was whisked off to some dream world that Nikki created, and all of a sudden, I go downstairs and the credits start rolling, and... Yeah, and then it took me to the main menu. Bitch, did I die? What the fuck did I do wrong? What, what is happening? That was a little loose. Shouldn't be the cause of the problem, though. Hmm. Might need to top off the oil. Gloves are like new, so that's not the problem. I guess that needs replacing. Peter! Dinner's almost ready! Yeah, be right there, Mom! This motherfucker better answer me in quick. It's just, okay. Meredith Quill, where do you keep your carving knives? Oh, there's one in the drawer, nearest the stove. All I see is a dull instrument fit for a child. <laughs> That's the one. I will have to bring you a Katathian blade on our next visit. We can slice through Can I pick that down? That's very generous, Drax. I just don't know how often I'll be chopping through something. <laughs> I can also supply a few recipes. My wife makes a delicious axe head soup. That sounds good. It actually tastes a lot better than it sounds. Well, the fiercest warriors swear by it. Well, in that case, how can I help you? Bro. I'm flarking starving. I know exactly what you said. Hey, uh, Quill, can you do something about your mic? There you are, Pete. I was just about to come out and call you again. Some things never change, I suppose. Ah, Quill, your mother was just telling us about your childhood. Just some of your better adventures. What is going also on? I promise, Peter. I promise. I can't believe I have you back. Uh, Mom, you're squeezing kind of tight. I didn't get a choice here before. Me. Stop. I can't believe... Seriously, Mom. Stop hugging me. P Peter. Damn. Uh. That's fucked up. That's fucked up. That's that's even that's fucked up even more for that trophy, bruh. 
this the form that you wanted? We can reach Nikki. Illusion. This, this better not important. be like some weird episode of the Twilight Zone. You guys aren't in there, are you? What the hell? If you wish you had. Hey, there's the Star Lord jacket. I remember taking this off or hanging it up. You don't want to run a lot of shit, bro. Finally! I need your help. Mom will be home for lunch soon, and I want everything to be perfect. Perfect? For her birthday. That's today. Did you forget again? Dad? Uh, no. No, of, of course not. I just don't remember falling asleep. Great. So, can you help me set everything up like we said yesterday? I just need help with the hollow projector, and then um, there's the cake and the present that we got her. I want everything to be perfect before she gets home. Oh, okay. Oh, wow. This looks amazing. Why Did would you, you white it? it now? Oh, no. I ordered it from the bakery plant. There's a bake? No! I baked it. Okay, that just leaves the present and projector. We are still on your mom's ship, right? Of course. You're so weird. Weird doesn't begin to cover it. Dad, the projector? Where the fuck is it then? Galaxy's greatest dad. Is that supposed to be me? Obviously. Where's the projector at? Don't forget the present. <laughs> Woman? Kid. Is that a TV on your bed? You hurting. <laughs> hey, you still have Chewy? Yeah, he's captain of the Milano. Why don't I remember this? Did you find it? Yeah. Okay, put it with the others. Great, the gift. Put it on the table. Well, damn. Projector still needs to be fixed. Hmm. Uh, Nick, is it supposed to be fuzzy? Uh, obviously not. It's not focused right or something. Can you refocus it? Wow. It turned out so good. I was sure I messed part of it up. Wait, did you make this? Yeah. It's hollow, and the star system around it, and I think I got all the moons. It's beautiful. Just need Mom's present now. I think it's somewhere in my room. I did the bit. Hmm. Ah, that table. Got it. One birthday present. What did you get her? We got it. On Nowhere. Remember the artist's alley we went to in the painting she really liked? A pre law? Oh, right. Yeah. Anything else? I don't think so. How does it look? Amazing. Your mom's gonna love it. Thanks, Dad. I love you. Uh, wow. <laughs> okay, I, uh... Nikki? 
Why is the door locked? It's them. I'll make sure everything's perfect. You get the door. Surprise! Peter? What are you two? No! <laughs> Don't believe it, Peter. This isn't real. She's being tricked. She never should have been here. What she saw. Ooh, she got eight. I don't know how, but the three of us are connected now. That thing, that thing has her, but she can still be saved. She has to accept my death. She must. Damn, she did. Show her how to let me go. Free my daughter. Save her. You have proven yourselves unworthy. Bitch for And you must be destroyed. No. Ah, this is wrong. What did you do to us? Fucking mind games. I'm gonna puke. Puke later. Focus on Raker. Oh, what the hell? I can't run. Don't go with your grandpa. He cheats. Significant. possible. Circumvent electrical hazards. For now, the choir's pissed. Ready! These guys with a pride for creepy and costumes. They are a mockery. Watch your body. I was just trying to wake him up. Stop that shit.
purpose, would he? That would not make sense. The dog report is ongoing. The boss had camping up his buddy. Let's sever his ties that bind. Rocket, go wild. Keep running. Scott, Scott, Scott in! Go, go, go! God damn. We may yet escape. Hurry, bitch, hurry. No Run fast. Wasn't clear. That's a pool of instant death. <laughs> what the? Drax! Drax, man, uh, everything okay? Yes. Okay, so maybe it ain't warp drive cooling. Okay, so we're just supposed to jump down. <laughs> That's tingly. Well, we need to talk about your kid trying to kill Raker us. Raker did something to her. This is his... Do you think they reached the old mining sector? No. The Grand Unifier said Lictor drones into the lower halls. The heretics would have been disintegrated. Scut holes. Scut holes. Yeah, maybe. But if we are lost, at least they can't find us. We're screwed. We're lost and we're screwed. I just need to get my bearings. I ain't never been on a ship this big. Trust your instincts, little one. Uh, little one? Eh, guess it's better than abomination. <laughs> you are a silly little thing. Scott, what are they doing? Blocking our way forward. So many doors. You do know the way out, right? Do now. There's Gubbins. You named it Gubbins? Yup. Watch this. He's gonna take us to the comm center. There. Gubbins. That's our exit. So we gotta go through them then. Okay. We got this. Let's take the rocket. More up. More up. Hey, look. They 
These idiots don't see us yet. No time to scare sure them fighting these dudes. The faster we get out, the faster we save Nikki. You mean the faster we find the Milano? We're not leaving her. Just follow Cummins. He's showing us the way out. Oh, yes, Cummins. You trust that thing? Of course. He's one of us now. Rocky, fireworks. Pointless fight. Get us out of here, Quill. Drawing. Oh, wait. It's a training room, Groot! Rush him, Drax! Move, move, move! Flark, get in here! Stand back! Nice. So, Gubbins is gonna need his own space on the Milano. Somebody's gonna have to... No! Gubbins! <laughs> <laughs> Who's gonna be the sex guardian? Yeah. I love playing scrap. It's a dead end. Now what? Up there. That cat walks our way out. If we can get across that gap. Flark, we got a bigger problem. Drone's back. Quill, find us a way up to that catwalk before we're extra crispy. Peter, tell me you've got an idea here. That pillar's top heavy. Drax, push that across the gap. Yes. No, 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 no! Wrong way, Drax! What the Scott, man? Drax! What? You fat headed platoon? That was ours! Doesn't matter! We got an exit! Let's go! Well, that thing really wants a piece of you. Too bad, they're my pieces. We should keep moving. Oh, more this doesn't look, look good, Peter. Whoa. Is this some kind of torture chamber? They look peaceful. For now. Hey, uh. Until they're dead. Are you okay? I might as well be back on Half World. Some of my fellow experiments bought into this kind of scut. The Cree scientists told them we were chosen, and they tailed the snout believed it. Even as they were dying. But you didn't. I was one of the well, smart ones. Me and, uh. I can't stand looking at him. Let's get the flark out of here. I've had enough of this nightmare. Tell me we're close to your comm center. Gobbin sent us this he way. He sent us to a dead end. It wasn't a dead end for him. Actually. Let's just hope Drax's shortcut leads us in the same direction. Yes, the shortcut. Those are different. Gonna put a bullet in one of these flarkers Damn. for every people battery in this place. That's a lot of bullets. I got enough. There's the leaf. Could not save him from death. where he death. came from. Oh. Well, What's their end game yeah, here? Look. Forced indoctrination of the entire galaxy? He seems to believe the lies that he creates. A dangerous trait. Me? I need to know where Rager went. He doesn't survive this. We won't get him alone again. It's too risky. Peter, cut to pieces. <laughs> Let's burn these sick freaks. Guys, damn it. Up. Fuck, I don't mean. Oh, my God. Celebrate this moment, my friends! Victory shall soon be ours! We shall carve our name in the history books, Peter Quill, and it will not be spelled incorrectly! You think we're in trouble? From these guys? Well, I say trouble is our middle name! Who said we were in trouble? When we're slicing scuts with a knife or a blade, when we're shooting fast and Groot's making shade, that's what I call trouble. Who's with me? That's the kind of wish we were. Let's 
see where we are. Here too. Rocket, do your magic. Yeah, yeah. Just let me do it. Oh, fucker. What? That must be the calm relay. Or take it off this heap. So, uh, how long is this gonna take? I'm gonna need your help. Sure. Alright. Just stand right here. Okay. Perfect. <sighs> what? Why are we pretending we did not witness what was witnessed in the ceremonial chamber? Because the promise is an insidious lie. How can you be certain? Because I wanted to believe it, but I knew when I woke up it... <sighs> it wasn't true. will be gone. What did you see? Or her on the planet? <laughs> I saw my mom. Life. There was something else there, too. Yeah, exactly. Whatever it is, it's using the girl. Probably fed her alive her own. About Corral. I know she's a walking sky dog. What? That was completely intentional. The Milano's on her way. Whisper on fire. Thanks, buddy. <laughs> Let's split, before the Faith Brigade realizes what we did. The Faith Brigade? Where's the Milano supposed to dock? <laughs> it's cute they use the word dock. She doesn't have hangar clearance, so we're gonna have to get creative. Okay, just don't go overboard. That's exactly what we're gonna do. I found a rendezvous spot near the hull. Wait, what? Relax, I know where we're going. <laughs> Peter, there's a workbench we can use. Better safe than sorry. Let's get it done. All right. Let's get it done. Let's see, Tarsha. Whoever hit the footsteps or hit the footsteps, try and make them out of the room. Try and resign. Uh, increase shield point to above 50%. Increase shield point to above 50%. Generate shield point for the full combat. Increase health. Advisor to Quill. <laughs> uh, drop an additional health to those who are going to leave or after a judgment of death avoid all the health. I could really use a flark and drink right now. Now let's get out of here while we still can. Yep. Just grab them. One of those faith batteries is supposed to fit in here. Jeez, Quill, considering that's what I just told you. Got a lazy death bot here. This battery might still have some juice. Worth a try. Okay. Whoa, whoa! Ugh. Not cool. Bitches. Mm. Can't dodge with it. That would have just been too. Do you know what you're saved. doing? Sure. Battery in the battery slot, right? Will Let's this work? The way to find out. Look it up. Hey. Looks like it worked. Let's go. Let's get Somebody want a patch to the employer? Drax, you coming, man? Drax, use your brain. Hello. Also, I'm Uber and I can't watch. Gotcha. Wait. They coming on? Get your asses. 
I have topics we must discuss. Now's not the time for it. Come on, Drax. Hey, Drax. What's wrong? It has occurred to me that this may be nothing more than a lingering dream. It's not, I promise. But we need to go. Very well. That is kind of scary. Yeah. I've never heard any music. ship make that noise. Not even Jatari. Is that singing? Yep. More like distant chanting. Whatever it is, that's a lot of people. We have to go this way. Hey guys, whatever's up there, I just want you to know that there's nobody I'd rather have uh, by my. Is now really the best time for a we're about to die speech? Block. Whatever that is, it's really close. This is... Flark. There must be millions of them. At least. I am Groot. Yeah, and how are we supposed to help? We need to worry about getting our own tails off this death trap. We survive. And we make sure Cogswell knows everything about this nightmare. He'll know what to do. The church comes for us! Flark! Think we can hijack that skiff? Probably. It'll be an ugly hack. Take these off, people! I'm surprised your gun even has a safety! Shh. Hope the rest of you are as ready for this as I am! Rocket! Blast up! I have slain a believer! Don't mourn him, feed him! Put her right down! Oh, keep her still, Rocket! I would if Hell these yeah. Larknards would quit fighting back! Timber! Fyodor Orlf handled the group nice. Yeah, this whole ship stinks. It's body odor. Faithful don't seem to wash. That's disgusting. Okay, let's see what we can do with this scud. Come on. Man, just... Come on. You sure you can? Whoa! If just one small faith battery can power one of their robots, imagine the power they harness here. And they're conquering planets now. Even this is small scale. Did you hear that? Hear what? It was... Whoa! We're okay. They're just bouncing off the shield. What the scut? Shields down! Blast them! Keep your heads down! I got this! They're crawling really? out of the woodwork! Uh, I don't seem to have this, bro. Uh, let them come! They all got skiffs! We just need to find a docked one! Got one. Flark, this thing's going down. We gotta dock this heap fast. They're trying to distract oh, us from Rocket. We need a new skiff that ain't got holes in it. They're trying to pin us in. Their mistake. Try to stand real close together. They're not killing the others. For the glitz of Rocket. The blood had amping up his body. He must eliminate their medicinal conduit. Can I see a way out of here? Yeah, on the top with all the moving parts. Experience? Yeah! Why? Why not? I thought Baker made 
We'd want to bring back a prisoner for questioning. You want to drag one of these bloat holes all the way back with you? You're doing it yourself. I am Groot. Ah, Groot makes a good point. We don't even know if they're contagious. Ain't worth the risk. There's our ride. Come on! I've been on here, bro. Waiting on you. Whatever's going on here, once we're out, I don't want no part of it. I am Groot. There's no end to them! Rocky, can you outrun them? How? We've got the same skip! Crap, the shield's blown! You gotta keep them off of us! Oh, fuck. Where are they? Why do they fight us? Because they're a loony space cult! We're hit! How bad is it? Bad! I've gotta put her down! Oh. Again? Damn, do I just suck that bad? Take the damn fast! We need to get off this thing! I would if these spark nards would quit fighting back! Shit! Ah, oh, damn. Those fucking robot things. Not good! Get ready for a fight! Crash! Destroy! Never see Prepare coming. yourself, Steve! Groot, you're a- What is all this? Hey, Flick! Put it down before I can take out your eyeball! We need to focus on taking it down! Get a group! Eat this! Take it on, bro. Oh, wow! Remind me not to piss off Groot! Why do they fight us? They have a death wish! Oh, you got it! Slice and dice! Order up! Toss them around! They're crawling out of the woodwork! Big tech! Let them come! Oh, guys, what do we do about this big bot? He can't get us all! Come on, guys! Let's mob the bot! Shit. Take the damn bat! We need to get off this thing! Oh. Skip here! Why am I 
I'm gonna be able to access that. Ah, shit, no. Another one of those death traps! You wanna stay on this one? Good Hilarious. point! Where's the shield? I don't know! It ain't working! Gonna have to do without it! They're on us again! Where are they? Fuck. I am an idiot. Where the fuck? We must return to the ship. There is work to be done. Yeah, that's kind of the goal here. Good. Yeah, good. This thing's falling apart! Come on! Got one. We're almost there! Are we gonna make it? No! Oh, I that was a spell. Watch out! They're coming from all sides! Oh, let them come! I guess I could be the first to use the Mechamora. I hate the boys on the side. No more skiffs! I think we trashed them all anyways. Let's go. Oh, shit. Oh, Downtown. Oh. Hang on. You feel that? No. Vibrations are different. Getting close to the edge of the ship, and our way out of here. You can detect that? Hello, whiskers. Broke another cultist! Having fun praying on the weak? Push down the sun ball! Beaches. Whoa. Oh. Uh oh. We got another scut ton of goons coming our way. Voice is down. Guys, let's fire some time. What will that accomplish? Oh, that. Any longer rodent. Your battle skills are sloppy and erratic. My skills? You've got all the subtlety of a brain dead battering ram. Say the word, Peter Cloak, and I shall single handedly tear these fiends apart. Whoa, 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 guys! These insults you keep tossing around, are we a team or should we just throw each other's lives away? Because the only thing that matters here is that we knock them out together. Who's with me? I am with you, Peter Quill. Let's go. Oh, yeah. Fuck it! New gum! Rip him a new one! Ah. No time to get distracted! We're gonna be late! It is never too late! My goodness, it's never too late. 
I'm getting real tired of wasting people. I am too. No, I ain't changed. I mean, I need a break. Just for a day or two. So I can get some feeling back in my trigger finger. Uh, I am hilarious. Too. Yeah, what happens if Gamora don't catch up? Once they realize we're on the Milano, they'll throw everything they got at us. I will not leave Hovat behind again. Flark, how's that thing still dogging us? Run! Go! I the music. hate everything in I this mean, ship. it's it's on streaming mode, and I didn't do anything to the music. What you hear is what you hear. Jump! What? Jump! We need to keep moving forward. God damn it! Fuck you! Crown time, bitch! Kick their foot. Bitch! Stay down. Should get here any tick Back now. to Uber and Should? I go my yeah. last ride. Well, so it's the best I can do. Can and our window oh, to meter yay. is getting smaller. You know they're gonna oh, open fire yeah. as soon as they detect her. Yep, I've gotta run in silence. But who knows what kind of sensors Raker has on this thing. <laughs> Another cultist! Well! Bob's away, Rocket! <laughs> Round him up, crew! <laughs> You gonna listen while you're driving soon? Rocket, how's it going? Okay, this one's set. K 
Keep the loonies busy while I rig the next one. I don't know if we can keep this up. You have to. You have to. <laughs> that one doesn't look full. Neither does that one. Oh shit. Ground pound, bitch. My rock. Don't want to rush you, but hey, stop rushing me. I'll <laughs> just walk right into that one. Get off the skin, bro. Why do I get no order in this fight? Because you're hungover or something. Yeah! I love hearing Zappazelli. Well, I swear to Scott, if you let them shoot me in the ass, don't worry, we got you covered, man. You're no shit! Maybe it's right on side. Oh, shit. I hear way too much shooting. Get over it, bro. Space, bro. Where's the Milano? There is the Milano. Damn, lost it over. Doubt they could defrost that quickly. Is Gamora still on there though? We gotta see a Kaneki and Gamora. Sprees as much as the next guy, but we barely got out of there alive. What about Gamora? She, she made a choice. Uh, so you're just gonna Rocky, abandon her fucked. and Nikki? What if it was Groot? You gonna leave him behind too? <laughs> Don't talk like that. That's not what this is about. Isn't it though? We're supposed to be a team. Teams don't leave people behind. Tell that to the giant Kratakan army of robots and brainwashed believers we barely got away from. Raker lives. For now. <laughs> For we now. have to go back. 
We can't leave Nikki there. What he'll turn her into. Blah, blah, fuck it, blah. So you got stepdaddy issues and had a horrible job. Ooh, rocket! Damn. What? It's true. Guess what? You ain't the only one here who had it bad. It don't mean we're angling to commit suicide because some pseudo priest nutjob is doing surprise nutjob stuff. Man, this is Guardians of if the Galaxy. If we go back there, two. we're dead. D E D. Rocket. Dead. I rather die with honor than without. <laughs> Who crawled up her butt and died? You. <laughs> so, get the flark out of dodge? Not yet. We should try to get a hold of Cosmo instead. <laughs> Great plan, only he ain't answering the passport. Okay, but what choice do we have? We don't have comms. Well, actually, we uh, might have comms. It turns out they weren't as flarked as I originally thought. Really? Groot should be able to raise it. Okay. Get the fucking off my ship, Sounds bro. like murder mom's feeling more stabby than usual. Hey, murder better mom. not slice through anything in that cargo bay. We ain't restocking anytime soon. Hark, excuse me. I Chew, chew, move over. What are you looking at? Oh no, you ain't chewing through any more of my ship. My ship. Chew, flark off. Wow, that panel must have looked really tasty. What's it for, anyways? Emergency door controls for the ship. Something a ship owner should know. Hey, do I look like an engineer? You don't. Junior engineer, I'll have you know. I want to talk through. I want to see. How about you, bud? You doing okay? <laughs> Are you sure? You saw some pretty messed up stuff in there. I am Groot. Yeah. Maybe I'm not the best person to discuss it with you. <laughs> you and Rocket should definitely talk about it, though. <sighs> I'm glad you guys are there for each other. Take care, buddy. I am Groot. I want to discuss the translator, you motherfucker. Working on rocket? Uh, just a little upgrade for the Milano's weapon systems. I told you I'd put that quarantine zone tech to good use if you hit it from Nova Corps. Cool. How soon can we try it out? Uh, depends on how long you're gonna stand there bothering me. You want something? I bought something in nowhere to remove that Nova Corps lock. <laughs> The guy said it was a lock disabler. It's not? Piece of junk disabler is what it is. Oh. How do I have to say this again? No shopping for tech without rocket. Fine. Give me a tick. I'll be right there. No, I don't think I'm Hey, right Star Scut. I hope you appreciate me more after all that. Hey, Drax, you okay? Drax? You want some chicken soup? Always helps when I'm down. Hey, Gamora. Go away, Peter. Damn. Come on. Just thought I'd check in. That was some... Pretty heavy stuff you said earlier. Wanna talk about it? I don't need a pep talk. Okay, fine then. Just take care. I'm doing just that. Yeah, right. I'll let you go back to uh, 
studying the blade. Could you move? Dang. Ooh, I'm about headed with these motherfuckers. Can't exactly complete a routine if you're walking about. In case it wasn't clear, you're in the way. Fuck out of you right now. I need space. Bitch, I'm not even near you. Anything yet? Guardian of Galaxies. Cosmo, buddy. Where have you been? We've been calling you. Sorry, Peter Quill. Cosmo's bow has been tied. Universal Church of Truth arrive at nowhere. Are you okay? He's fine for a moment. Cosmo receive warning in time. But Continuum Cortex is a shutdown for safety. It's been dead, huh? Your little detective trip almost got us killed. We'll fill you in when we get there. Ned, this problem is bigger than Cosmo. Guardian of Galaxies must go to Xandar and ask World Mind for help instead. Cosmo unable. Get through. Guardian of Galaxies must actually. Damn. Cosmo, are you there? What happened? Oh, Alright, disabled them. He's a. Oh, shit. No, we're about to get fucked up. Oh, I hope this isn't a space mission. Are we under attack? So these are the cowards who defiled Lady Hellbender's honor. Oh, Good God, this bitch fuck are you? Normally, I would not engage in conversation with inferior life forms. Bitch, fuck. My contract with Lady Hellbender stipulates otherwise. Therefore, abomination. You may refer to me by my title. I am Captain Glory, leader of the Lethal Legion. <laughs> A lethal legion? Uh, more like loser legion. <laughs> Us. Listen, I get that Lady Hellbender's super pissed, but now's really not the best time. Did you think that she would ease her bounty simply because you somehow managed to elude the Blood Brothers in nowhere? Yes. Then you were as imbecilic as they are. You will not elude me. That I can assure you. I just need a few minutes. Stall him, Quill. Why? Oh, Where are you going? Him. offering you anyway is it like a lot are you making a counter offer maybe depends what would it take nothing everyone's got a price glory even you i don't expect those of lower races to understand the basic principles of honor and superiority when i commit to a contract i follow through always yeah okay I wonder what for race he is. Honor, then. I cannot be bought. Certainly not by low-life scum such as yourselves. I am Glavri of the Kree Empire, and I look forward to the day when the Kree race eliminates your inferior species. Spoken like a true Kree. <laughs> Are all Kree not blue? More like an arrogant a-hole. Enough! I will not be disrespected. You will be eliminated. Give it your best shot, Helmet Head. The Milano's gonna blow you out of the sky. Your ship doesn't have that kind of firepower. Scan again. Possible. Just a little something we picked up in the uh, quarantine zone. So. Looks like you underestimated us. Hilarious. Blow them out the fucking sky. Jeez. 
this. How much money did she offer these guys? Doesn't matter. She wasted her money. Got a piece of that guy. Bitch. These shots ain't dying fast enough. That's a fixable That's problem. to inverted flight controls. This is garbage. Hit them hard and give no order. There's nothing about that garbage scout. That flight is a channel with less butthole content. The Flarkers are forcing it open somehow. Feel free to panic. Their dying cries will be recorded as proof of your demise. What the hell? Start to 
sound like rocket. It's called language efficiency, well. Hoodie. Starting to feel like we pissed off the whole galaxy. A good shot of them anyway. We really need to work on our PR. Chapter 10? Yep. The old girl needs a tune-up. We can do it once we reach the station. I ain't letting no bucket head near my... Wow. Talk about cosmic gridlock. Damn. I haven't seen this many ships around Xandar since the start of the Galactic War. Open the channel, Groot. Let's see what's going on. Come from converted worlds. They're refugees. Need immediate docking permission. Please answer us. Groot, that's enough. I don't see any rescue shuttles coming out. They're ignoring them. No. No, 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 no. Nova Corps might be a bunch of self-righteous dome heads, but they're they're supposed to be helping folk. That's their whole flark and deal. Relax, <laughs> Rocket. We'll just call the station and ask to speak to the world mind. Groot. Welcome to Novacore headquarters. Please state your preferred language of communication. English is standard galactic. I know, bud. But now we can all follow along with Starpants' mistakes. How may we assist you? Hunter must choose quickly, little one. The allocation of resources for direct communication with us has been denied. We apologize for the inconvenience. Fuck. Well, it was worth a shot. Let's try something else. Just pick something, Peter. Congratulations on your decision to join the Corps. To begin, state your full name, designation, or serial number. Richard Ryder. Quill's mom! This strategy is futile. Oh, uh, come on, muscle brain. It might work. Oh, please give your celestial body or artificial installation of origin. <laughs> Someplace. Earth. Earth. I continue to doubt this strategy. Sheesh. Yeah, maybe it won't be. Finally, Finally, in a few words, to describe, describe what made you want to join Nova Corps. Because I'm a sucker. Justice. <laughs> Looks like the best AI in the world couldn't parse that. Good job, boys. Please stop that. <laughs> All right, so that was fun, but a complete waste of time. Any other ideas? I know. Let's join the core and rob them. We should report what Raker is up to. Think the Flarkin world mind doesn't already know? I know. Let's join the core and rob them. After, After scanning your ship, our, our near perfect, perfect algorithms pre selected several officer choices. 
Nova's profiling us? That ain't okay. Nova Prime's identity is confidential. And communication with them is forbidden. Until further notice. Huh. Doesn't say which one. Why even list them then? Large brute. Brute wants us to report a crime. Only, Only one, one application per cycle is permitted. And you cannot resume a cancelled application. How about future crime? We are aware of the current threat, but can devote no resources toward fighting it. Thank you for being proactive. However, the galaxy's impending doom makes all future crimes irrelevant. We should tell them about the promise. Right. As if none of these other ships ain't already blasting about it all over the comms. Yes. Connecting, Connecting to banking services. Connecting. I can't believe that worked. Gardeners of the galaxy. Gardeners. Explain, Explain yourselves. Hey, world mine. Long time no see. It's me. Peter Quill, Star Lord. And, uh, it's Guardians of the Galaxy. Check the addendum. We need your help. To pay a fine? No. No, of course not. You need to save the, the galaxy. galaxy. cannot be saved, Peter Quill. What? A mass, a mass delusion, delusion known as the Promise is sweeping its systems, converting, converting all who encounter it. In less than, than three cycles, it has spread, spread from the crew of a single star frigate to multiple outposts, worlds, and systems. Thanks. Axis 9, Rigel 3. 75.222% of the Andromeda galaxy, all lost. Of course, she don't mention Contraxia. They, actually, the world mine is collected. Consciousness. Look, we know who's behind the promise. We've seen it happening up close and personal. We're here to pass on information to you so you can stop How, How can, can we be more clear? The Universal Church of Truth cannot be stopped. <laughs> They're a collective. It is a machine. Yeah, well, so are parts of me. And you better not call me a Look, we just escaped the church's mothership. We have a ton of intel you can use to bring them down. There is nothing you can tell us we do not already know. Pretty sure I know a few things that even a supercomputer can't know. Such as? Well, how to groom the feathers on a Shi'ar warbird, for starters. Are you still alive? Because I know how to groom the feathers. Yeah, well, I know where you can buy hack Nova Core helmets at ridiculously discounted prices. What? They obviously don't know about it, or they do something. The point is, we've lived things, experienced things. We've survived the promise, and maybe our experience can be used to help you bring them down. It is possible. We, we have, have overlooked, overlooked the value of individual experiential memories stored within our files. I like how the voice blushes. However, However like the given the ill-defined parameters of such a query, undertaking a search protocol at this time is ill-advised. Now, if you will excuse us. The Universal Church of Truth's forces draw closer to this region of space. It is critical that we depart before they arrive. You're running away? What about the refugees? You're just gonna leave them defenseless? Our primary directive is the preservation, preservation of Xandarian culture. All, All else is secondary. Hey, do you Damn. see what your planet looks like? Xandarian culture is a lost cause. Culture, culture is more than a location. But you're Nova Corps' leader. You have a duty to protect this galaxy. That, that is incorrect. You ain't the leader of the Bucketheads? We do, we do not have a duty to protect this galaxy. We merely police it to get advanced knowledge of potential threats. Serve and protect only yourselves. A logical byproduct of our primary directive. I have officers all over the galaxy laying down their lives for you. And you won't even risk fighting for their sake? The risk is too great. It would be a pointless sacrifice. No reasons. The church is stockpiling resources. Its influence has grown beyond all probabilistic models. Then update your models. We cannot adjust, adjust our computations to the enemy's nonsensical power source. You mean faith energy? 
Faith, as an energy source, is illogical. We are unable to compute scenarios to fight that which should not exist. So you're just gonna let the church win? If the power source cannot be quantified, it, it cannot be countered. Most sentient beings don't have the luxury of calculating their odds before getting into a fight. Don't you control the Nova Force, the magical energy that powers Nova Core? It is not magical. But yes. Then how do you explain that one? Because to an outsider, it doesn't seem logical at all. Thanos used to say it was generated by the living computers of Xandar. The living computers of Xandar are the Nova Force. Nova Force. It exists because we exist. exist. And we exist, therefore it does. Sounds like you're able to harness your collective energy just like Breaker with other people's faith. Maybe the way you do it can tell you how the church does. Perhaps. You, you have given us new data to consider. Guardians of the Galaxy. We hey. will. Later. Right now we need to focus on our departure. You're still leaving? We did we not, not make this decision without considering all available options. A complete search of our databanks only revealed a single entity with the potential to stop them. What is it? Not what. Who? Adam Warlock. The Church's original Golden God. Unfortunately, he perished in the last year of the Galactic War. Great. So, no one? We are pleased you reached the same conclusion we did. It appears that our travel preparations are almost complete. Farewell, Guardians of the Galaxy. No, 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 wait! Classic Nova Corps. Ain't helped us then, you won't help us now. What? Are you kidding me? Groot says the Flarkin helpline's still asking for fine money. <sighs> All right, let's get this over with. Confirm payment. Oh, what? Whole universe is about to end, and you spend our cash on a Nova Corps fine. Look, dude, the church is about to come for all of us. Once that disabler goes off, we'll be sitting ducks. All right, at least we got that sorted. Let's get out of here. Peter, we've got movement. They're taking off. Wow. Fucking bitches. All are some fucking bitches. Damn. Well. Oh well, shit. I see it. <sighs> Son of a schmack. Son of a schmack. Jump, Quill. I know. Those promises becoming real. Peter? Gotta get clear first. Come on. And go! Scott! Whoa! Shit. What the flark did you do? I don't know. Why have we stopped? The loser legion must have hit something when they ambushed us. Guys, it's only a matter of time before the galaxy accepts the promise. Sacrosanct is back there. We can't just sit here. Guys. And how are we going to do that? We're dead in the flock and water. And they they find find us. Us. Freely accepted. Oh, yeah. And without an engine, we're screwed guys, anyway. Guys, 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 guys. Enough. Just stop already. I can't hear myself think. Rocket, fix the engines. How am I supposed to do that? I can't even run a diagnosis. I don't care. Just fix it. Scoff. And what are we supposed to do? I don't know. Okay? I can't just conjure up answers every two seconds. Fine. I expect that of a leader. 
Come up with something yourselves. Don't. I, I just... got rid of his skin. Can't do this right now. <sighs> I need some rest. I don't remember him taking Chewie with him. Supposed to do something. Relax in your quarters. Wow. Screw Noble Corps. Shouldn't have counted on them in the first place. Jesus is shit. Look, it's our great leader. I'm sick of you. Rocket Star Lord. Really? How did you. Ugh. Come on, girl. Shoot, shoot. Screw it. And the bed smells. Great. <laughs> There's supposed to be music playing. Okay. Good blamer. Oh, really? 10 times 24. Interesting. Hold on. We have a shit. Yo, tunes. Uh, uh Dragon Ball Sparking you. Zero just uh, Weird air. became available for pre-order. Guess what uh, comes out? How are you? Ten, ten, twenty-four. Me. Come on, on your the birthday, motherfucker. You. Everybody is. Uh, Rocket, yeah, he was fixing that thing that broke. Hey, if we're some kind of big space hero now, why are we running from the bad guys? Uh, it's complicated. No, it's not. Stop running. And we've landed. Uh, landed on the <clears throat> Groot wanted to let you sleep. Can you believe it? Oh, how long was I out? Long enough to fly us all the way to the quarantine zone. Wait, how do we fly out here? Well, do you want to fix your ship or not? My ship. So you flew us all the way here. Yep. Without asking. Hey, I asked. You said, and I quote, I'll take you to the stars. I'll show you who we are. We're space riders with no name. Uh, and then you went back to sleep. And you thought that meant yes. Good enough for me. Hilarious. That's rocket rounds. Star Wars rounds. So what's the plan here? We just picking up any junk we find? Not Rats any junk. Room. We're here for a second Rizzo? near Cato Catalyst nope. with a blotting handle. Hmm? Huh? Plus, I'm missing an optical induction cable adapter. If we can find a plasma hutch box, we'll be halfway there. There's a box. Right. I know that word. Let's go, there. I guess. Let's go. Oh shit, everyone's here. Great, back where it all started. Step one, step one. Look who stumbled out of bed. 
The rodents made decisions in your sleep. Yeah, yeah, I know. Took you long enough? What? Nikki? You're not supposed to be here. You promised you would get me out of here. I know, but... <sighs> Nikki! He's still dreaming. Tell me twice! Oh, damn, you just left me fucking dog. Hovat and Camaria will be restored. Uh, d yeah, okay. Uh, we just need to have faith. Oh. <laughs> uh, Drax, you're kind of freaking me out, man. I had to share the good news, Peter Quill. You have lost your family, your mother, the Cree woman. You understand the pain that comes from loss. Drax. But with faith, with the Matriarch's promise, our families can be restored. I, I, Drax, I don't... You have accepted her promise, have you not, Peter Quill? I've... Totally accepted it. I am super stoked to, to see my mom again. And rejoin your daughter. Y yes, right, right, my, my daughter. I knew you would see the truth of her light, Peter Quill. Yep, uh, the truth and light, dead. Not dead, uh, my daughter, it's all super great. This pleases me. I'm less certain than the others. The wooden one may come around, but I suspect the assassin and the rodent will resist. Mm -hmm. This makes them a dangerous element to our cause. I must eliminate them. Wait! Why? Because <laughs> they're our family, man. Just give them a chance. It's a lot to process. Truly believe they will accept her promise? I, I know it. Uh, take Gamora. Her dad was Thanos. There's gonna be some stuff to work through before she can accept it. And and Rocket. <laughs> Where to start? He's literally a walking science experiment. What Nikki, uh, the, the matriarch, is, is offering, it's, it's all new territory for him. And the wooden one? You said it yourself. He'll come around. I mean, it's Groot, man. He's our rock. <laughs> More like our brain. Very well, Peter Quill. Good, uh, good. That's 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 great. Um, I'll, I'll let the others know. Ah, there is no need. We must bring the matriarch here. We'll give them the time they require to consider her promise. Right, uh, right. Because she's a million light years away, and it'll take us time to get there. Already landed on her planet. What? what? Why? Why would you do that? Well, I 
If you had truly accepted her promise, you would know. Perhaps it is better that you wait here for a while and contemplate your faith. Wait! Drax! We can talk about this! Great. I'm here, Rocket! Oh, thanks, Flark. Peter? Rocket? Why is my door locked from the outside? Yeah. Drax may have kind of joined the what? church. What? Seriously? I am Groot. I know, it's, it, it's super messed up, Drax. Drax is kind of messed up. He also may have landed us on Sacrosag to find the matriarch. But don't Damn. worry. Don't worry? Yeah, you know. Be happy. Might be able to activate the Milano self-destruct sequence. That's your plan? <laughs> what, you got a better one? A little hard to concentrate with Peter singing. I'm thinking. Ah, uh, think somewhere else. Stop singing. For your information, the Lama thing finds my voice delightful. Her name's Cammy. That's it. We're locked in, but she's not. So, she's an idiot. Doesn't mean she can't help us. Can you transfer ship schematics to my tablet? Maybe get me a camera feed. Yeah, okay. Why? I want to check where Cam is. Done. Go ahead and grab it. Shit. Not that, motherfucker. What are you thinking, Quill? Bruh. Are you Groot? I don't know what he's doing. Looking for his tablet, I guess. Peter, do you have a plan? Okay, I see her. Gamora, sing something, anything. Why? Just do it! <sighs> this is me singing a song. I hope you like it because I don't. Oh, wow. She hates your voice. Fuck you! It's good! Fuck she responds you. to singing. Maybe if we direct her to that panel near the cockpit... The emergency door controls. Yes! Just keep singing. I'll use the PA and try to lure her to chew the lock override. She chews everything. Let's see. Oh. Well, don't worry. Be happy. Be happy. Don't worry. Be happy now. I think it's. Son of a bitch. Here's a little song I wrote. Uh, something, something, note for note. Peter, do I really have to do this? I mean, Cammy's a space llama. One who apparently doesn't even like my voice. Ugh. Blah, <laughs> <sighs> blah, 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 blah. <laughs>
galaxy. And this is the best plan we could come up with, huh? You got... <laughs> everything and now we gotta sing to this be happy mm. when you worry your face will frown and that will bring everybody blah 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 okay come on girl give it a little nibble uh, do what you do best you toothy bastard <laughs> guys I think she's doing it About time. Fuck that bird. <laughs> I can't believe it worked. Did it though? <sighs> We're not on the sacrosanct. We're on a planet. Well, that's a flark and relief. I knew Drax Let's get the was scud out of here before it. Drax comes back with his new best friend, the Protakin Matriarch. Rocket, stop! We can't just abandon Drax. Is he even still Drax? I mean, he's been converted. I know. It's just we need to There's find him and pull him back from the dark side. Him, I'm sure. You're talking about kidnapping Drax the Destroyer. Emphasis on Destroyer. <laughs> and we've come too far, seen too much awful stuff to abandon one of our friends. Drax is still our friend. That ain't our friend no more. Don't make me pull rank on this, man. Are you pointing your frickin' guns at me? Uh -oh. No. Not yet. I just need you to understand how serious this is. We're not leaving. Well, it's about Kratak in time you showed some Nords. Fine. I'm in. That's all it took. Hilarious. Any other objections? Nope. I'm good. I'm good. Good. I'm good. Then let's go find our friend. Let's go, buddies. So, Fuck the where are we, anyways? Definitely. Okay, here we go. Not this place. In a flocking lagoon? How many times I gotta Jesus, tell you people, I creepy, don't bro. like water! Hey, I didn't land here, props. okay? Drax did. Ah, the stuff is gross! It's water! Uh, are you kidding me? Ah, wet fur is the worst! <laughs> ah! <laughs> Fuck it! You oh, alright? down, buddy. That's it! I hate water! I hate being wet! And I hate not getting paid! We're not here to get paid. We're here to save tracks. There we go. Guys, this is Lamentus, home of the priests of Pama. More religious nut jobs. Great. They aren't nuts. Yeah. They're pacifist exiles. Pacifist. That's even worse. <laughs> you saw them on nowhere? So how do you know this place? I came here after a job went bad. What kind of job? Shit. Are you telling me we ain't crossing above an ocean? Only part of an ocean. Uh. <laughs> Don't fall and you won't get wet. Yeah? Well, how do you know Drax didn't fall? Quit worrying, Rocket. Anything happens, Gamora will jump in after you. I will? You will? <laughs> yes, because we're a team. And Gamora's the most sprightly. <laughs> Found Drax! Oh, shit. Where is she? Where is the matriarch? Whoa, whoa, whoa! Put him down! Drax! Buddy, just calm down! No, she called me here! Men lost! Rock a little help here! Uh. <laughs> <laughs> Hilarious! What the fuck? Colored Mantis for a reason, shit. 
Okay, she whooped his ass. Okay. Mantis? Mantis got moved. How did you... What? Oh, that. Lysa once taught me the art of striking one spot and many times. There's an arm bad who teaches me later. <laughs> Don't worry, Green Mimi's fine. <sighs> Green Mimi's fine. Green Mimi. What are we doing here, Mantis? I told him to come. On nowhere. I saw time inside his mind. The lies that bind. I mean, what's a girl to do? Whisper a course correct, obviously. Damn, she knew he was gonna turn it's okay. on nowhere. That's crazy. Stay with me. Quiet in the dark. Another one of your girlfriends, Quill? Oh, no. <laughs> Not in this time. Come on. <laughs> the creepy cave's this way. The what now? The creepy cave, where the darkest of our future paths will meet. Dark isn't unknown, not as in bad. I mean, it might be bad. But no way can it be worse than the futures I did see, because those were definitely bad, very bad. You don't want to know how bad. Can someone please translate her? I am Groot. The point is, <laughs> or was, or... Which parts of the point have I made already? Uh, the oh. creepy cave. Okay. Yes, that's right. Big strong heart carries so much sorrow inside. In all futures, he's the one who turns. And in some, we save him. Here. So Mantis can see the future through a tunnel? And here we are, where the Kotati take root. So, just to be clear, there's a timeline where me and you... Peter, focus. Right. Hilarious. Um, what's a Katati? At least that's not the timeline mm. like. Uh, plant people that's like group, but uh, lame. Lover. The Kotati are a highly evolved, highly sacred race of pacifist beings who grace us with their meditative powers. They also guard the secrets of the ancient Root cave. seems uh, awe inspired. Can they temporarily unguard it? Oh no, they take this duty quite seriously. Our only hope of entering is to appeal to their infinite wisdom. <gasps> oh, shit! <laughs> well, all right then. And we're in. Hey, yo, those clones green eyes are pretty dope. Looking for in here? Guess what uh, comes she out. doesn't know. Something that's gonna 10, help Drax. On your birthday, motherfucker. All just taking the word of the space case. She's not a space. Ooh, spooky. Kind of reminds me of. Uh, Spooky's right. The fortress is more like deadly. Are we sure about this? Nope. Maybe Drax just needs to sleep it off. Double floor. <laughs> Everyone just remember we're here for tracks. So it would be easier if we had some idea of what we're looking for. Oh, for sure. It's always easier when you know things. Like, no, no. But you don't. Oh, maybe. This place is really unstable. Classic cave's gonna kill us all. Oh, no, not all of us. Not this time. Oh. More water? What's wrong with this lousy planet? Come on, Rocket. Water's not gonna hurt you. Death by drowning is actually quite common throughout Little Fuzzy's alternate future. I have heard so many of his panicked final gasps. Okay, let's not tell Little Fuzzy that. Too late. <laughs> I'm sure it'll get drier from here on out. Oh, you. I, yeah! Giddy up! Crap! It's kinda close. That one sometimes gets Gamora. Damn. You are sure we're headed the right way, Mantis? 
Let's take a look through here. Maybe there's another way to cross. All right, Gamora, let's get up here. Why don't I just blast some of these rocks? Oh, no! I don't trust them not to kill us. What's your reason? I have seen so many futures where a little fuzzy dies in this cave. Rocket, you feeling lucky? Yo, geniuses. This thing about me don't look too sturdy. Not to lose, we got our grid. Still ignoring the bigger problem of not knowing what we're looking for. Don't focus on what. Focus on how much he means to you. Uh, all the times Drax has done something for us. Name one time. Remember when he saved our butts in that mining ship? Uh, this is a lot of trouble to go to for a freaking colleague. Tell us how you <laughs> really feel. Drax has definitely been there for us before. Like on Seknar. First time we got jumped by that tiger with the squid face. Who? Oh, Stumpy? And the second time we got jumped by Stumpy. Uh, Mantis? Should we be worried about this fog? those things living on this planet. Maybe they weren't native to Seknar? And this is where Hellbender Seknar. first got them? Or maybe Hellbender's here, tracking us across the ends of the galaxy, because she wants us dead. Lady H wants us dead. You realize what that means? We're all gonna die? I think I see what he's doing. It means we're a team. When we piss someone off, we piss them off together. I'm gonna assume that sounded better in your head. <laughs> Water, fog, and monsters. What's the fucking deal with this place? There has always been a great power the here. The, the priests there. tell tales of those who were here before them, and what wonderful things they could do. I don't remember hearing anything about that. You weren't ready to listen last time you were here. Why were you here again, Gamora? Oh, I know the answer! What the floor? There's two oh, of them! Oh, I like two that design. Those Mantis, do these things have anything to do with what we're looking for? Inconclusive, but I'm thinking no. What do you think, Quill? You best friends? Yeah, maybe Wait. not. So... Make like a tree! Oh, My blade barely stretches <laughs> these things! It really is tracks about now! Hold up, Rocket! Gamora, what a thrill! I should know these ones! Boo-boo! Oh, gross! Drax is probably admiring these walking teams! Ha! He's a 
Something we have to avoid. Mantis? Over here. All right. I like Drax as much as the next guy, but I am officially sick of this stupid cave. I am Groot. You, uh, see something out there, Mantis? So many things, too many things. Shadows of a civilization that lived here once before. Forlorn faces that can see like me, horrors yet to come. And other shadows, too. Ours, not ours. A figure that's watching us now. Or was watching us then? I see rocks and uh that's crystal creepy. things. A statue that looks like a face and more rocks. I like yours better. <laughs> I see something else. I see friends willing to die for another friend. Yeah, well, I'm hoping it doesn't come to that. Me, Me too, too, Star Guy. Star Guy. Me too. We'll each need to face our fears. Some here, some not. But facing them is most hey. important. You know, there running is sometimes there. good too. Found another way. Just me or them crystals look super dangerous. Don't worry your fuzzy little head. You only die from a great fall in two timelines. This probably isn't one of them. Well, this led to nowhere. Yeah, nowhere. Bitch, can I go back here? Your bark's crawling. I'd almost jump into the water if it made the creepy crawly feeling go away. Oh, okay, cool. Uh, we need to get on those crystals, Groot. Just let Quill get out there first. I don't want you falling. Hey, materials. I like materials. Oh, definitely remembering something now, I think. We need to be careful here. I think what you're seeing is some version of me pushing you off a cliff. Oh, <laughs> little fuzzy. Your volatility is surprisingly consistent through all versions of time and space. Mantis, back in nowhere, did you know what the church was going to do? I don't know. I see so many different things at the same time, it's sometimes hard to know where I am. Do they try to take over the galaxy in all realities? Not fuck? all, but is most. Child sometimes it's so thing? noisy, like a bajillion ships taking off at the same time. Do you even have a chance of stopping them? Finally, the face of a thousand lives, I think. It's gonna help us save Drax? It tries Bruh. to keep us What's from saving him. Children? We seek something behind the face. mentioned the faces in the dark before, but I always thought it was metaphorical. Bug Lady is absolutely bonkers. Can you get us through here, Gamora? Clark, I'm going in. No, you mustn't. You don't want me to cut the thing? Wait, no, not you. Something bad is about to happen. Quill. Bug lady said. 
that the face is keeping us from helping Drax. So we gotta destroy it. Little Fuzzy, don't do whatever it is you're about to do. No, no, no. Do. I'm done with Wait. all the riddles. Don't not, mm. not do whatever you have to do. Do not do. not do. Okay. Give me a tick to think, okay? Well, if the whole place collapses, then at least you wouldn't have to argue with him anymore. Not helping. Rude, can you tell him to stop? What the fuck? Fuck it, go! Fuck it! This dumb motherfucker. Oh, hell. Yeah. You want to know the plan? Yep. Then you run! Fuck it, run! Who the fuck is laughing at us? Mm. Oh, hell. Woo. Close one. You say that again. Oh, I will. <laughs> uh, Mantis. Little Fluffy! Oh, shit. Where's the matriarch? This is the one where I failed. Oh. We're trying to help you! It's okay. One where I fail is the one where you don't. Saying that. Survey! Are you smart? Why didn't I know that? Maybe you aren't always. Or I forgot. What? Those guns do something again, Quill? He saved Drax after you almost killed us all. How do a gun do that? Show him! Show that! That's interesting. And that's how it's done. Eh, me exploding stuff is still better. It's really not. Next time we're in a huge fight, you're gonna beg me to blow stuff up. Bag me! Next time we're in a huge fight. More of that weird fog. Uh, Be glad you ain't this hell. close to the ground. Oh, little Fuzzy never dies from gas in here. Just falling, crushing, towery, Wait, water. hang on. Did you say Shatari? Oh, I did, didn't I? That's a funny sounding word. Headshot, headshot, close up. This is very effective against This is impossible! Bitch. I hoped I never would. Bitch. If I never see a Shatari again, it'll be too soon. You couldn't have warned us that Shatari were hiding out in this cave. They aren't always. Some timelines we just run into cute little eyeball guys. The other ones I'm talking about, Star Guy? I'm familiar with eyeball guys, yes. What I don't uh. get is why they be here. Man, what is this? Like the worst timeline? Bye bitch. bye, little guy! This sure beats therapy! <laughs> <laughs> bitch!
Over that already, didn't we? Yeah, we did. A while ago. That thing of yours is still bothering you, though. But how far down does this cave go? Heads up. More than rock monsters. I don't think they're looking to make amends, Quench. Oh, maybe I can help. I think I speak their language. Oh, oh shit. Well, as expected, I was sure. Oh, maybe I just haven't learned it yet. I think I picked up the word for kill or the grunt anyway. But the fog doesn't seem to bother whatever these giant things are. Maybe they're just smart enough to not wander around in it, unlike some people. I know why we're doing it. Um, guys, uh uh, no way. No flarkin' way. It doesn't seem that wet. Like, medium wet. I ain't walking through a flarkin' monsoon! Maybe there's a way to use those <laughs> plants that divert the water. We're a team. We'll figure it out. Are we seriously gonna let this keep us from saving tracks? Sure! You save him while I drown! I don't think he can grow down here. No. Those big leaves could be useful. Like, damn. Yes! Just a plan for him, not a you plan. But we ain't got much choice. What do you think, Rocket? Doesn't seem that bad for you. 
translate to rocket don't rocket don't like wet we get it it's a scary dark cave we're all probably going to encounter things we don't like true but nothing as much as little fuzzy doesn't like getting wet never underestimate someone's deeply rooted fear sir fry especially when you do not understand the root actually kind of refreshing. Like a quick shower. Mora, let's climb up there. Get eyes on the problem. But the problem is that Rocky needs to suck it up. Yeah, good luck with that. In Little Fuzzy's defense, he has died drowning in far less water than this. Exactly. Wait, what? This doesn't seem absurd to you? He's got a thing with water. What do you want Ooh. me to do? You're what? supposed to be his leader. Have you met Rocket? Help me. Bug lady, exactly how many times you seen us die horribly? Oh, it's too sad to count. I always have to stop around 50. Great, that's 10 apiece. Oh, no, 50,000, little fuzzy. Just like that. <laughs> Please, don't give him an even bigger head than he's already got. Drew, let's see about crossing. <laughs> Says no way, not without me. Glad someone's got my back. There are timelines in which Little Fuzzy moves mountains for you. In this one, you must block an ocean for him. Big group. I am Groot. He ain't gonna let you leave me. It's not that. I just want some help up here. Alright, he'll do it. Hilarious. Hey, if I jump, you can catch me, right? Guess we'll find out. That's... Not very reassuring. Well, just don't wow. screw up the jump. Why don't we just leave him behind? Focus on saving Drax. He'll still be here on the way back, and if he isn't, Groot would never go for that. Too bad you don't have these sweet guns, Rocket. Keep it up, and I'll swipe him in your sleep. <laughs> Suddenly missing Drax's anecdotes about Katath. Oh, you know he has some Katathian fairy tale related to our current situation. Like the Katathian equivalent of Jack and the Giant Beanstalk. Oh my lord, these fucking things. Crew, let's see about crossing. Says no way, not without me. Glad someone's got my back. There are timelines in which Little Fuzzy moves mountains for you. In this one, you must block an ocean for him. Ocean? Really? To him? Yes. Shit. Let's play elevator, Groot. Here's good. Up we go, Groot. Just about there. No, it ain't none of their business. What's to understand? I ain't a fan of drowning. Oh my god, how am I supposed to stop this fucking water? Need some help up. Sure, How no problem. Here? Going ahead. 
Mantis, any of those realities where we just leave Rocket here, hypothetically speaking? Oh, yeah. Anywhere I don't kill them all for abandoning me? Hypothetically speaking? Oh, little one. Sometimes you die trying to get out. Before we left the ship! Plans to divert the waterfalls. How am I supposed to move them, motherfucker? Please tell me. Please elaborate. Easy, Green. We'll figure it out. So this. Jack Beanstalk guy. Is that an Earth hero? Kinda. Basically, he plants some magic beans and they grow into this giant plant, which obviously he climbs. He don't know where to get magic beans, you big galoot. Absolutely. A dry rocket is a happy rocket. This is you happy? Oh, yes. You should see some of the dark versions of Little Fuzzy. Or maybe you shouldn't. You really, really shouldn't. This crab corridor ring any bells, Mantis? Pretty sure this is the wet part. Oh, what now? I thought we just did the wet part. Oh, please be cool. Please be cool. Everyone okay? I'd be seeing stars if I could see anything at all. Yeah, this ain't good. So, about all them futures where we die. Has he always been able to do that? He says he don't like showing off. Thanks, buddy. <laughs> no, I don't gotta tell him. Oh, right. The thing that you tell us in the dark. It's really important. No, it ain't! Shut up! You're among friends, Rocket. It's nothing, okay? Just... The lab I was in detests on me in tubes of water. And it sucked. It really, really sucked. Sensory deprivation experience on Half-World. I heard of those. Sensory deprivation was like a vacation compared to the other things. Ooh, this part. Mm. Okay, anyone else getting really fed up with little Miss Cryptic? Yes. Pretty? <laughs> Give me a break. At least it seems less dark through here, and less wet. Uh, there's now. that creepy fog again. Fuck. It's always here. Always. Until it isn't. What's that supposed to- I don't- More Hellraisers. Wait, yeah. 
But it ain't those flarknards. It's them creepy eyeball things from the QZ. I'm definitely hearing Hellraisers. Then you ain't hearing right. It's eyeball things. I can't things. tell. It's not clear. Well, it's clear to me. These ears don't lie, lady. Shh. What do you mean, shh? It's your guy's right. Shh. And about what? Shh. There's a new way out. So it was nothing. I think it depends. It's got something to do with the freaky fog. So the key all along was to keep quiet? Every time you name an enemy, it has the power to make that enemy appear. Yeah, like that was ever gonna happen. I saw so many versions of us fighting so many different things, but the source? It's not done with us yet, Guardians. Yeah, well, let's just keep our eyes open and our mouths shut from now on. The fog enemy has retreated from us. There's no immediate risk. Yeah, no offense, bug lady, but nothing you say means anything anymore. So the fog is an entity now? Yes! Sort of. Obviously, if some fog monster's trying to kill us, it means we're getting closer to whatever it is we're looking for. That kind of makes sense. And if this fog monster can make bad things appear, maybe the opposite is true. Like if we all say cure tracks, maybe that's what we've been looking for the whole time. I wish, Star Guy. But no. The one time she gives a definite answer. Just like that. In one possible timeline, we all get smushed. Great. Atlantis is annoying the fuck out of me, bro. Let me guess. Further down. Only if you want to do that and the whole galaxy. I'm gonna get back to you. Okay, okay. Look, guys, um, <clears throat> I appreciate what you all did for me back there with the water thing, um, but following the bug lady any deeper is officially stupid. Rocket. No. <laughs> I agree. Bog monsters? Cave pigs? Wet waterfalls? Technically, <laughs> all water... No, no, Quill. She doesn't know where we are. She doesn't know where we're going. She doesn't know what we're looking for. Mantis, are we hot or cold? Room temperature. Okay, okay. Oh <laughs> this is crazy. He is probably crazy. It's not about her. It's about us. I am super proud of us. Because we've never gone this far for anything before. Oh, this is the one where you inspire them. Just think about who we were when we started. Um... Well, you were a two-bit broke pirate who couldn't even outrun a tree. Exactly. And you were a two-bit bounty hunter. Yep. Just as broke it. as me. Just as depraved, self-centered, mindlessly chasing every unit, bar, contract, bank to rob. I still <laughs> like many of those things. So do I. But none of those things are why we're here now. Right? You're down here kicking ass for Drax. Not Drax the Destroyer, not Drax the Rampaging Criminal. Drax, man! Hey, Gamora, you've gone to the ends of the galaxy to hunt people, to hurt people, to get revenge in what I can only assume are some excruciatingly painful ways. But doesn't this feel kind of good? Going this far to help someone you care about? Oh, it feels so good. Yeah, I grew. Uh, he says you don't have to. No, no, I do. Because we all need to learn something from you, man. You never complain. Or if you do, I don't catch it. But I, I, I'm pretty sure you probably definitely don't. You're always there for us. And that's what this is about. Us. Growing together as a team. Following a crazy lady into a death cave. Because one of us needs help. Because we are a team. Help, we're a family. We're the fucking guardians of the galaxy. Yay! Really great speech, Will. Why did anyone stop me? You're on such a roll! I can't it turn really my head. Oh, shit. Bitch, fuck out of here.
Did that for us. Hey, a friend needed help. Bunch of them. Rocket, man. Hey. Yeah. Boy, please just save tracks already. Warm? Very, very warm. Yeah. I think she wants us to jump in the hole. I may not know what we're looking for, but I know it's down there. Okay, let's finish this, because I sure as flock didn't get all wet for nothing. <laughs> Thing. Doesn't matter what's down here. If it can bring us back our grumpy Katapian, I'm all in. And the rest of you should be too. Come on, guys. We're the freaking guardians of the galaxy. Um, is that supposed to be me? I heard you make that speech so many times. And then Gamora says something like, We're here. Home of the healing light. Source of the cure. Origin of Raker's power. It's... A cocoon? Told you she was gonna feed us to some. Oh, gross! 
Please tell me Drax is the only one who's got to go in that creepy egg sack. So the shepherds found fresh flock. Ooh, Adam Warlock. Damn. Foolish followers. Think fast, beard butt. Damn. You know not the gravity of your treacherous trespass. You cannot quell a god. Prepare for oblivion, interloper. Oh, what's this one? Okay, Green Meanie, you're up. Green Meanie. <laughs> Found you. <laughs> what wayward wickedness is this? Nasty uglies from that busted noggin of yours. Okay, guys, it's him, Aaron Witchcraft. <laughs> no, wait, Aiden Warsock. <laughs> Adam Warlock? That's it, the Golden God guy. Hold on. God this guy. guy's Raker's old divine whatever. Looks pretty good for a dead guy. Were you not sent by the sanctimonious shepherd? Us? With Raker? Not a chance. We're trying to shut his ass down. See? Friend. Friends. Okay, big guy. And we go. Come on! All the ones where we die already happen. <laughs> Raker's got half the galaxy going cuckoo bananas. Her friend included. I swapped your ass for a newer, younger, blue-skinned model. So, can you help us? Mantis seems to think you can cure Drax. My heavenly healing is veiled malignance. A first folly I swore never to repeat. Can someone translate this guy? He said no. What protection I can proffer is to remain reclusive. Not this time, Goldie. The pieces need to go back together. We just gotta get you all closer to the puzzle. And that would be... In here, of course. Whoa, wait, let, let's talk about... What the butt? It's like the beginning of Space Odyssey. Welcome to the Astral Plane, Snorlord. You just teleported us? Oh, no. You're still comfy cozy with me. I just merged your mind. One second, people. Merged or what? I gave no consent to this planescaper. She's not big on asking permission. It's all pretty sure this and fate of the galaxy that. Don't you get huffy, God Guy. Your gold hands are all over this mess. What's that supposed to mean? I thought this guy was how we cure Drax. Cure and cause can coalesce. Uh, guys? Is that Drax? Hi, Groot. So we're going into Drax's head. Literally. Green Meanie's in there somewhere. Find him. Convince him to come back to reality. Uh, Mantis, please tell me we're supposed to be going into the bright light. Pretty sure. You need to reach the heart of Drax's promise. Damn, I Much sure deeper than I've ever seen. Wait, if you've never seen it, does that mean it never happens? Hope not. Just keep going. And if we lose contact, listen to Amy Winsaw. She means you. 
you. Quite clearly. Amy wins. This is Drax's one. promise. Mine was a lot less downery. This is just the doorstep. Poor guy was stuck here, reliving the loss of his family. Your friend's fear and pain primed him as prey. There's the big galoot. That was easy. This is just an echo, little fuzzy. Uh, <laughs> well, you're not the only one that hears that, right? <laughs> That's what Thanos looks like. <laughs> Here we go. Please be something soft down there. <laughs> Drax? Not Drax. Thanos. Bet you weren't expecting nice. a family reunion. Hey, good morning. I mean, the design looks joyous. good, but the graphics look terrible. Oh, maybe ability unlocks. I barely the rock. Damn, Rocket! Finally, a dramatic fear of water to save his friend and free. Rocket, from all other strengths, has now deeply revealed the entirety of his massive arts of art and his bullet tests and his eyes. That was all the last of David's two of the army. Hope the rest of you are as ready for this as I am! Let's do this. Rocket! Rocket! After all, something's not right. You fail to fathom the rules of this realm. <laughs> oh, hell. What the? Okay, that's new. That's new, right? I think I'd remember there being two of them. Twice the ugly, twice the target practice. I think we did something, but I don't see Drax. Oh, good. Not creepy at all. Hold up. Look. His daughter. Not so fast, little one. Drax, wait up. Damn. Sorry, guys. I gotta cut it here. Gotta get ready for D and D. Saving this game. Hell yeah. Um. Other than that. That is a wrap, folks. I'll see you all next time. Peace.